Welcome to this video on working with images in placeholders in Microsoft PowerPoint. So if like me you have templates that you need to use that have already been preset in PowerPoint for the company branding that you're working um, and to make all of it re look really nice and easy for you to build a PowerPoint then you'll have placeholders and you'll have to work with them in PowerPoint and there's a few tips and tricks that I can give you to make it easier and to make your PowerPoint continue to look really great even when you're restricted about what you can do so I have a very basic slide here with a placeholder and I'm just going to add a picture into this okay I've added a picture in there and I know that this picture is more of a standard photo shape, but this placeholder is portrait rather than landscape. So I'm gonna be missing a little bit of information. Now what you'd expect you might want to do here is just to move this placeholder around, but what you'll see when you do is it starts to stretch and skew the image, which you don't want. You want the image to fit as best as possible within the placeholder. So I'm just gonna undo that. And then what I'm gonna do, instead of doing that, is I'm gonna click, I'm gonna right click, and I'm gonna click on crop. So I'm using a Mac, so your drop down might look a little bit different. You can also see in the top bar, if you click on picture format, there is a crop option there as well. But when I click on crop, you'll see I've got the picture behind the placeholder. Now what I can do here is I can reshape this picture by clicking on these corners and moving this, but I'm still leaving that placeholder exactly where it is. And also what I can do is click on that picture and move it around and find the area that's gonna look best for my picture so that I get a really solid picture in there. It looks nice and pretty, but I'm not missing anything. I'm not skewing it. I'm not stretching it. I'm not making it tiny. Um, and then if I click away, you can see there that I've still got that, that placeholder, that frame in exactly the same place, but I was able to just move that picture around, make it bigger, make it smaller, to make sure that it fits really nicely within there without having to move that placeholder, that frame. Remember, if you do move that, you're gonna to start to stretch or skew your image and it's not gonna look very professional at all. So do remember if you're dropping in any images into a placeholder, just like I did, then you're gonna click on it and click on crop either by right clicking or control and click or you're gonna go into picture format at the top and click on the crop option. And then you can see the whole picture behind that frame and you can move and work with that and work with what's best. So have a go at that one. Please do like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what videos you would like me to record in the future.